Well, good morning, good morning. Welcome back to North Dakota Today, everybody. Check this out. Red River Ambux is here with us. And this organization inspires mobility and independence by providing adaptive bikes to people within our community. So we have Kristen and Sarah here to tell us all about their upcoming fundraiser. Hi. Hello. Hello. Thank you for having us. Thank you so much for joining us and yes. for bringing in yes. one of the trikes. So yes. right off the bat, will you tell us what this is and what you guys do as an organization? Yes. So we're Red River Ambux and we, pr we are a, a local um, nonprofit um, in the Red River Valley and our goal is our and mission is to provide um, adaptive trikes for people of all ages from child to adult yeah. um, by working with PTs, OTs and speech nice. therapists to provide these adaptive trikes. Um, we have hand and foot trikes, which is this trike. Okay. Um, so for depends on their disability to uh, what trike is appropriate. We have regular foot trikes, and we also have just regular hand trikes. So really, this is to help instill mobility and independence for people with disabilities. Yes. Wonderful work that you guys do, and you have a big fundraiser coming up. So tell us about the event. Yes. Go ahead, Sarah. We do. We've partnered with Cycle Bar coming up on Sunday, this Sunday, September 25th and they are doing a cycle bar ride for us. The ride starts at 2.15. There's 30 bikes available mm -hmm. and you can come and ride. And um, even if you don't wanna do a, ride a cycle bar, you can certainly come and still show your support for a wonderful, um, a wonderful nonprofit like Ambux and um, come out and have some fun. We are also going to have the real good cookie van. Yes. Yes. You yes. both are holding some giant cookie treats in they're your hands. A, and they're a half pound. <laughs> oh my Each. gosh, you yes. get a workout yes. holding one of those. Yes. So tell us about the cookies and, and how this is helping the organization as well. Yes, so the real good cookie van, we just um, finished a two week uh, fundraiser with the real good cookies and she will also have her van at the cycle bar fundraiser and um, be selling cookies there that day from mm. two to four. Yum. So um, you can buy cookies there that day if you'd like and 10% of the profits um, that of the cookies that are bought there that day will be going back to Ambux. So say someone might not be able to make it out to the event, how can they get in touch with you guys and possibly donate monetary values or even yes. their time? Are you guys also looking for volunteers at this time? Well, right now, as far as we have provided 14 trikes in the community, we have 16 on back order. So when that oh, big wow. shipment comes in, then we might need more volunteers. We're, um, you know, with the pandemic, that has been an obstacle for us. But uh, um, we have a great guy, Dave, who volunteers in town that <laughs> puts these trikes together. But I think if all 16 come at one time, I think we might be in trouble. So well, shout out to Dave. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yes. Yes. Yeah. Yep. Yeah. Yeah. And the average trike costs about a thousand dollars. Oh wow! And uh, so that is why we're we, we are in need of raising funds to provide yeah. more of these trikes. We're just in awe of how much um, the community has embraced us and provided these trikes for for people in the Red River Valley. Well, I could see why this seems to be very important, and I'm sure it's helping yes. a lot of people who probably thought they wouldn't have access to something like this in their lifetime. So yep. incredible work. And I think you find this as 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 families, you know, as they're they're growing and their kids are growing, you may no longer be able to use that take along bike, and so this provides. Um, you know their own trike that they can ride you know side by side with yeah. their sibling or yeah. with their families and um, get outside and ride a bike. I love that and yes. then this is really quickly phase one of a bigger fundraiser so you guys have a goal for this upcoming event to lead to an yep. even bigger event right? So our goal is to raise um, three thousand dollars we participate um, last year we participated in Giving Hearts Day we are again um, many people don't realize you typically need to raise $3,000 to participate in Giving Hearts Day. Yeah. So that is our goal is to, to reach that. So once again, that we can participate um, in that upcoming fundraiser. Okay, really quickly, tell us again the details of your upcoming event. Yes, so Cycle Bar on Sunday, this coming Sunday from 2 to 4. If you want to ride, come out and ride. Otherwise, just come out and support this wonderful nonprofit um, and buy some cookies if you want to. <laughs> um, and our, and our link is on the Facebook page, Red River Ambux, to sign up for the Cycle Bar fundraiser. Yes. So. 
Yes, and or if you want to, um, we do have a Venmo, and you can always give a monetary donation if you aren't able to attend. Okay, perfect. Of course, that information there on your screen, we'll have more on our website as well. And a great excuse to fulfill that sweet tooth and get a cookie, a big cookie. <laughs> <laughs> and a bike ride. Yeah, right? <laughs> the cookie first and then take a ride. I love how that works. Thank you guys yeah. so much for joining us this morning. Thank you for and having us. Yeah, of course. A great organization and a lot of work goes into this. All right, everybody stick around. We will be back with plenty more North Dakota Today right here after the break.